so it's cold outside and your heat's only putting out lukewarm air. And that's not going to cut the mustard. So today I'm going to show you how to fix a heater that's putting out cold air by flushing it. Now heater cores make hot air. Hot water goes through them then the air blows and makes you hot. They'll often get clogged up inside. Now in the case of this Volvo it was pretty easy to figure out. These are the heater hoses that go to the heater core. This one was getting nice and hot, yet this one was cool, so we knew coolant wasn't flowing through. Now years ago, that could have been a bad heater control valve, but most modern cars, including this Volvo, don't use heater control valves. The heater core always has hot water flowing through it while the car's running. And inside the dash, there are what are called blend doors. They open when you want heat so the hot air goes through, and they close when you don't want heat. Now I have already checked the blend door operations with the fancy computer I have for Volvos. They're opening and closing right, but I already knew it wasn't that. Because even if the blend doors weren't working right, you'd still have hot water going through both of the hoses going to the heater. And it isn't. One's hot, one's cold, so it's clogged. Now to flush it out, we have to remove these, they're little plastic clips, and then put another hose on there and flush it using the garden hose and water. We squeeze and turn the plastic clips counterclockwise to get them off. And off it comes. And of course pull the other side off too. Then we get some heater hose that will fit over both ends so we can flush it with water. Just shove them on. Huh. One on each side. They get a bucket, put one of the hoses in there so the water will go in the bucket. They get some towels, wrap around the hose, and squirt it out. But as you can see here, only a little bit was coming out, so it's really clogged up inside. And in this case, I'm using an old trick. I use this lime away. It gets rid of a lot of corrosion. I will just pour it in there and let it soak for about 20 minutes. We'll just pour the lime away in using a funnel. Then we just have to wait. Half an hour, an hour is fine. It'll help clear off any of the crud that's in there, and then we'll blow it through with water again. Then we flush it out again. And as you can see, it's flowing a lot better now. Then we snap the hoses back on, fill the coolant back up, and start up the engine and let it warm up. Now we got nice hot air. Mm. And that's a good thing because replacing the heater core in this Volvo costs over a thousand dollars. And remember, if you have any car questions, just visit the Scotty Kilmer channel. And I'll answer them as soon as I get back from this glacier.